Hey guys, it's Mark here and welcome back to another video and today I am gonna attempt to try to change my iPhone 5C battery and I'm just gonna let you know how terrible it looks as you can see from the side profile it looks pretty good, pretty normal until you turn over to the other side it's like whoa and I checked the screen it is actually fine so I assume it's the battery issue so I went online and get a battery replacement and they sent me an iPhone 5S battery replacement and I'm not really sure that it, it is really compatible or not but you know what we'll give it a shot and try and see how it goes and let's go ahead and get started as you can see here the iPhone 5 here ahead right now is definitely working the screen is working everything is working so let's power it off and let's get it started so first thing first i am gonna use this so-called pentacle screw i guess and yeah apparently i only have one screw on one side so best of luck to myself and Yep, let's put that aside and yep I don't have a screw here so that's a bummer and everything is holding in place wow it's still it's actually quite hot and let's pry it open basically I don't need to do much to pry it open whoa I can see the separation oh my god it's so bad the separation looks so bad I probably should buy a new screen but right now I should just change the battery first because whoa look at it it's so bad as you can see the battery does not look so good and I feel like I'm gonna need to pry it open oh this is not gonna be good so I'm gonna need to I'm just gonna put this aside Put this aside it takes all the screws out this is a bad idea and i do not know why there's so many stickers honestly because it's a refurbished unit that i bought on some sketchy store but you know what if it works it works if it's fine it's fine just that the saddest part that my phone issue is that it does not have GPS no it does have GPS it's just it doesn't work very well and FYI guys I just remember I need to unscrew the battery first and why am I opening the screen up yeah I'm opening the screen so I can much much easier to install let's take away the screen I feel like this is still the, the easiest of doing the battery replacement compared to all the new iPhones but it works it works uh, top is the longer one and this I'm gonna pry it up I definitely need a new screen if you guys want me to change you want you guys want me to see me to change the new screen just like the video and drop a comment down below and remember do subscribe as well if you enjoy me feeling to do stuff oh it just came out like that okay i don't understand why oh my god this there's one screw that's missing that explain why is it so loose okay let's put that aside okay how do we do this there's no pull tab oh my god why don't they include a pull tab oh wait they do i think they do okay i am back with a metal prior i feel like this is like a jerry rig everything video but at the same time yeah it, it has a white background but i don't have a hot gun i mean a heat gun but i just need i feel like i'm doing a lot of mistakes right here oh wait there 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 it is there it is i found a pull tab yes oh my god oh this made things so much easier and this is always satisfying oh don't break oh it break it break okay 
do not try these at home, people. Yes, it's out and I bent the battery, so there's no going back. Bye. This is supposed to be satisfying. But why did you break? Okay, I am back. And after some time of removing the entire thing, um, I guess the first thing first is I'm going to try to figure out the extra screw. I hope the extra screw is actually from here because I would like to screw this back. Because it will perfectly make so much sense because did I drop it here? Is this the one? Okay, power it on. <gasps> it's alive! Yes, it works, it works, it works! Then the next thing we need to is to glue it, but at the same time, it's like this is like the bad, horrible choice I have right now especially the option that I have is only this so I'm just gonna stick with this but I'm gonna leave the top a little bit higher and longer so whenever I need to change the battery so I can have the pull tab much easier to change and then I can just drag it out and hopefully it does not go the way like just now but yeah I definitely need a new screen I feel like I'm not sure if you guys can see there is like a spot here that is like a space yeah Oh, sound. Am I not able to touch? Okay, that's good. It's either I destroy the screen, or something went wrong. Yeah, for sure there is something that went wrong. But overall. It feels great again. Okay, I can power it off. Then I didn't. I forgot how slow it is to power on an iPhone five C. And I still love the color of it. It's still great. Yeah, I still can't touch. Okay, I do not have that much option. So what I need to do is pull the battery out. And I can see the frame is stuck in there. So I would need to pry it out. Why would I think that put, fixing it back would actually help the touchscreen work spin? Why would I think that? I definitely need a new screen as the glue on the side and out of the, of the whole thing is definitely loose and wow look at that it's crazy but even though if I did I'm gonna need to put it back until I buy a new screen so Let's wait for another video. Thanks guys for watching. And remember to like and subscribe. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Of me trying to destroy my 5C. But yeah. Bye. I'm gonna try to fix it. If I can.